Welcome to Antarctica, the frozen bottom of the world, a place with no cities, no countries, and no native humans. Just ice, lots of ice. It's Earth's fifth largest continent, but 98% of it is covered in ice. And that ice, it holds about 70% of the planet's fresh water. Yep, this place is literally cool. No one owns Antarctica. Instead, over 50 countries signed a treaty in 1959, agreeing not to fight over it and to use it only for peaceful scientific research. It's basically one giant lab, surrounded by glaciers. There are no permanent residents, but around 1,000 to 5,000 scientists live here seasonally. Some are from the US, others from Russia, China, Argentina, even Bulgaria. The Antarctic is home to more international flags than any other frozen place on Earth. It's also the coldest, driest, and windiest continent on the planet. The lowest temperature ever recorded? Minus 128.6 degrees Fahrenheit. That's 89 2 dirts. Let's just say, your phone wouldn't last long, and neither would your eyelashes. And no, there are no polar bears here. They live in the Arctic. But you will find penguins, seals, and even whales, all thriving in some of the harshest conditions imaginable. There's also almost no plant life, just two types of grass, a few mosses, and that's about it. No trees, no flowers, just endless white and pure survival. So why do we care about Antarctica? Because it's a massive climate time capsule. It helps scientists study our planet's past and predict its future. It's one of the only places on Earth where peace, science, and nature all work together. And maybe, just maybe, it's where your future drinking water could come from. That's Antarctica, summarized.